Brace yourselves. This is... the place I saw in my mind. Um, you guys might think I'm weird for saying this, but... I've seen this place before. You too, Norma? Senny, you've seen it? It seems we've all seen an image of this place before. Unbelievable. What's going on? At any rate, we should begin looking around. Hmm. Did you figure anything out? There's writing on it, but I can't read it. Ain't so smart after all, are you? Hearing that from you makes me want to die. Let me see. 
Hmm, I've never seen writing like this before. It's not Rolaris. Could it be instructions on how to open the door? Looks like we're screwed if we can't read it. Nah, all we have to do is this. Hi-ya! See? Always trust in Norma. up in here feels like we're in the middle of a desert I'm sweating buckets sweating what's wrong Chloe oh nothing try to find any clues you can anything at all That's what we're about to find out. Why else would I tell you to touch it? Hey! Coolidge, be careful. A strange image just appeared in my head again. What did you see this time? I saw a white rectangular object floating in the ocean. What about the rest of you? Oh, we all saw the same thing. How nice. It felt like I was looking back over memories from long ago. But I've never seen that thing before. What was it? I'll go too. What did everyone see? 
A white rectangular thing with big patches of dirt here and there. Same here. So we all saw the same thing again. Third time we've seen this light. That was probably the same thing from before. So it's a continuation? This time it was completely covered with earth. Yes, let's. Every time we touch those lights, images appear in our minds. What is it we're seeing? Think, think, think. Why does the same scene enter everyone's heads? Ponder, ponder, ponder. Has anyone figured out anything? Cogitate, cogitate, cogitate. Nope, nothing. You sure seem like you're having a good time, Groon. Oh yes, this is quite fun. She really does think she's on a picnic. This one looks kind of tough. <laughs> If it gets any closer, then it will be yours. Don't go too far on your own. Lightning! Alpha Tempest! Sir Ring Driver! Here, use this! Chloe, take him down! Got it! First day! We never lose! We never lose!
brace yourselves. That interrupted the Aeris. Phantom Dragon Dance! That interrupted the Aeris. Don't take your eyes off him. I'll eat this. Sorry, I forgot to go easy on you. Is this a dead end? There's another one. I think that's the fourth now. I'm sure we'll see something when we touch this one, too. Oh, this is so exciting. As long as it's showing us images, it could at least add some explanations. This is... Lewin Spring? The water is so beautiful. Did we just teleport here? Look at that. The ruins are different. Yes, all the broken parts have been restored. The forest around here is kind of weird, too. All the big trees are gone. Shirley? Huh? How did she move just now? Shirley, wait! Coolidge! When did those people get here? I didn't notice them before. Shirley! Shirley, what's wrong? Can't you hear me? She vanished. Where'd she go? What's that? Look, over there. Something big's coming. a gate? What, are you kidding me? Are we going to have to fight that? Oh, I get it! This is the real test to get my sacred heirs! Uh, this one looks kind of... Go, go, go! Uh, it's a whirlwind death! Like... Hey, Sorry, we're we're going to go! Whirlwind 
wrong with that? I should keep some for later. Go, go, go! How is this? Swallow storm! Here, you can't! Billy! Who's this? Bowser, Sword Rain Demon! Shield! Let's see, go! Sword Rain! Sword Rain Tiger! How is this? Swallow storm! Here, use this! I should help out a little. Shield! before we defeated it. Uh-oh, he's in nerd mode. Well, of course. Gates are the lords of all beasts, the most legendary of legendary monsters. One doesn't get very many chances to study them. Marinus, why are you sacrificing yourself? It's all the fault of the Auraranus. If it weren't for them, Things wouldn't have come to this! The wings of light are a truly terrible thing. However, we have no choice but to use them now. Can't we do anything? Can we just stand by and watch the Marinus? Whose voices are those? Beloved Baroness, my life ends here. The rest I leave to the next Marinus. Please work together to bring a new light to our people. History begins anew today, and you shall rule over its birth. You are the Terraces. Are we back at the entrance? So it would seem. What's going on? I suddenly feel exhausted. Me too. Is everyone all right? Cupo, Peepo, Popo, what are you doing here? We'd heard you'd gone inside the lighthouse, so we came after you. It's about time we found you. We looked all over. You seem tired. Come rest at our camp. You made a camp? Oh, you're such a doll. Let's go. What's this? 
Let's see. Is this a tablet or something? It might turn out to be a clue. Let's go ahead and take it with us. Yeah. I never thought I'd see a gate with my own eyes. I should have given it a more thorough examination. It was supposed to give me sacred airs. I'd love the chance to encounter another. Yeah, and next time I'm getting my sacred airs. I'll pass, thanks. That thing was way too strong. I'm getting sleepy. The waves feel like a lullaby. <sighs> that was a nice nap. Huh? It's pitch black. I found out what's going on above. At this point, the war hasn't started yet. The 
city is surrounded by Sentinel forces, but they haven't taken any other action. Did you hear anything about Shirley? I'm afraid not. I see. So what exactly were those images we saw? I suspect they were images of the birth of the Kingdom of Terrasis. So that white rectangular thing was the basis for the legacy? The place we're standing right now exists inside that very object. That was most likely a ship as well. So the Radiant actually built land on top of a pre-existing ship. How'd they pull that off? Was it the power of the Marinus? Most likely. I heard a voice say something about the work of the Marinus. I'm curious about the Wings of Light they mentioned. Wings of Light? That's something new to keep in mind. Is it just me, or do we have even more mysteries now? I also wonder why such a legendary beast as a gate appeared there. To give me sacred airs, why else? Moses, please shut up. That Shirley we saw, what was that? It looked like an illusion to me. She didn't respond a bit when you were calling out to her. The real Shirley wouldn't have acted like that. Still, I have to say... The Radiant have some strange habits. Even if they were looking for a new place to live, they didn't need to create an entire island on their own. I'm sure the Farinus didn't do that just because they wanted to. They must have had a homeland somewhere. And they must have had a very good reason to throw it away. Sinnoh, you really care about Shirley a lot, don't you? If what Senel says is in fact true, that still leaves the question of why. Yeah, what could that good reason have been? What was that? Did you all see that? It felt like we were being told to go there, to that place we just saw. Looks like someone just answered your question, Senny. But who's that someone? We didn't just happen to wind up here. Someone led us here. I don't know who it is, but they must be nearby and listening to our conversations. That would certainly explain a lot. Let's slow down and observe the situation until we find out who it is. Understood. Everyone, be on guard. Alright, let's call it a day. It's already night. We'll set out again in the morning. Okay. Yeah, okay. Let's stay here in this house until we meet up with Stella. Oh, okay. Don't worry, she'll be here soon, she promised. Senno? What's with that face? You look so serious. Why are you doing all this for me? Well, you know. Thanks to you, we've located the village. Good work. Am I trying to atone? Or maybe... I'd do anything to protect you, to keep you safe. Alright, let's head out. I see. You may be right. Great job picking up on that. It was nothing. What are you guys talking about? This place we're in might be the quiet land spoken of in Orosaurin lore. It's a place said to have been visited by the legendary Orosaur Nero, Capoe Rocco. Capoe Rocco? Interesting, Interesting name. name. Supposedly it's a quiet land with a quiet sea. This place is just like the one in the legends. Then from now on, let's call this the Quiet Lands. I like the sound of that. Underground cavern is kind of uninspiring. Yay! 
If these are indeed the Quiet Lands, then the trail across the heavens may be here somewhere. The trail across the heavens is a path that isn't a path, floating in the sky. The legends say that Capo Iraco encountered something of that nature. We'll look around while you all are out. Thanks. yourselves. And, uh, anyway... Could this be the place from that vision earlier? This is definitely it. It matches my memory of it perfectly. And mine as well, even though it's the first time I've been here. Hey, what's that sound? Uh-oh. So this is where you were, Senel. Walter! Walter? To think you'd run and hide in the Fallen Lands. You're just wasting your time. You cannot escape me. This time, you will die. 
Oh yeah? It ends here. Felquestus! Huh? Was that all it did last time? Doesn't seem all that impressive now. Yeah, that was nowhere near as strong as last time. Wh what's going on? Your heiress not working as you'd hoped? Impossible! This can't be happening! Now's our chance! I possess the blessings of Nerephus. You have no chance against me. Think again, Wally. We can use Eris. That's Shirley's Terraquest. Is she around here? Uh. Marinus, what are you doing? Release me! Marinus! He's gone. Damn, he got away! It looked more like he was carried away against his will. Shirley? Where are you? If you're here, answer me! It doesn't seem like she is. Which means she sent that Terraquis from above. Shirley. Walter used the phrase, fallen lands. It would seem that's what the Radiant call the quiet lands. That name certainly sounds significant. Yes, investigating this place may be even more important than we thought. Well, while he's gone and all, so let's go in. Since when did kicking become the new way to open doors? Watching Norma, it's hard to believe she's really a Crystal Aaron. Shirley, were you protecting Walter? in here. <sighs> the temperature dropped so suddenly, it feels like we're in an ice house. Maybe it's just my imagination, but every time we see these images, I feel really tired. It's not your imagination. I feel the same way. What did everyone see this time? The white rectangular ship was next to land. Same here. Me too. Ditto. 
It seems we all saw the same thing then. Looks strong. Second line. This time it looked like the ship was heading out to sea. Yes, I saw the same thing. As did I. yourselves. There's a third one. Okay, let's do it then. What was that? An image of the mainland? It looked oddly damaged. Like it was just a bunch of ruins or something. Pressing up against me. Darling, don't leave me. I am not your personal heater. <laughs> Was it that obvious? Hey, cut that out. What are you getting upset about, Chloe? 
I'm not upset. Of course not. Well, good luck with that. But what? If you really want him, you better reel him in before Cheryl gets back. What? <laughs> What's wrong, Chloe? Huh? Oh, nothing. What are you looking at? What's with you? Coward. Me? Field? Has the fighting already begun? No, I don't think this is the legacy. Judging from our surroundings, I'd say we're somewhere on the mainland. 
Are we looking at images from the past? I'd say so. But when is this from? That I don't know. At any rate, this suggests there was a great war between humans and the Radiant in the past. There are lots of women and children among the Radiant bodies. They're obviously civilians. Why would... Shirley! Are you here somewhere? Shirley, what's going on? <gasps> Coolidge, what is it? Wow, she disappeared! She's over there. Coolidge? Huh? Oh, sorry. Let's go. Look over there! There's someone dressed like Shirley! So is she the Marinus too? This feeling, it's just like when the gate appeared last time. Don't tell me. Whoa, there it is! Is that a gate too? Yes, it looks different from the earlier one, but there's no mistaking it. This one looks kind of tough. Ooh, I'll eat this. Dance play. Can't take much more. Swallow storm. Eagle rising. Spread. Serpent tiger. Prove it. I'll eat this. I'll eat this. Serpent tiger. I'll eat this. I'll eat this. Flame blade. I'll eat this. Serpent tiger. Swallow storm.
more, I miss my chance to get a sample. Oh, that's too bad, dear. Kill them! Kill the Radiant! Force the monsters back into the sea! You are Raranus bastards! If only you'd never come here! Protect the Marinus at all costs! Baroness, the time has come for us to board the Ark. We shall leave this land that has consumed the blood of so many of our brethren. We will escape the yoke of the Araranus and begin anew. What the hell did we just watch? Come on, guys, we can talk about that later. Let's get back to camp. What's wrong, Senel? You look worried. That surely we just saw. Yeah? I've never seen a look like that on Shirley's face the entire time I've known her. Is this a tablet? Another one? Let's see. Looks like a picture of what we just saw. I've pretty much confirmed Shirley's location. Where? The Bow of the Legacy, in a castle remaining from the Terraces era. You mean Mirage Palace? Whoa! Is that a problem? It's famous among treasure hunters for being completely secure. You can't get in. It's a ruin surrounded by tall mountains and deep forests that's said to be unapproachable by land. 
It can be seen, but never reached. That's why it's called Mirage Palace. I'll ask the Orosaurin to see if they can find a way in. Although, the way things are now, even if we made it there, we wouldn't stand a chance against them. Now, let's go over the images we saw earlier. It looks like the reason the Radiant abandoned their homeland was a war. Most likely the humans won and chased the Radiant from the mainland. The Radiant may consider both that past war and Vaklov's actions to be the fault of the entire human race. How are we supposed to deal with them if they already got that in their heads? That's what makes race wars so difficult. Is that what whoever showed us that war wanted to tell us? That it's impossible for us to make peace? That's not true! Look at me. Shirley and I got along fine for three years. Sure, we have our differences, but in the end, it's all up to how each person thinks, right? We could do something if only both sides would meet each other halfway. Don't worry, Sennel. Sure, y'all are fighting now, but you and Shirley will make up your family. Family. Yeah, that's right. Now that we know as much as we do, I really want to know what's at the root of all this. Yes. Why do humans and fairness hate each other? Aha! I saw it! I saw it! Looks like our next destination has been set. Whoever it is, it seems they're still listening to our conversation. Spot, have you noticed anything? Nothing, huh? There's probably nobody around here but us. What does that mean? I have a feeling I know who this someone is. Who? Well... I think it's best I don't say for now. What? It's difficult for even me to believe. So let me try to get some conclusive evidence first. All right, I think we're done for today. Senel, are you prepared to learn the reason why humans and the Radiant hate each other? Of course. Good. work as an Alliance Marine? I'll work too if we need money. You don't have to push yourself so hard. Sorry, I just think it's best if you stay inside. For now at least. Besides, I like it when I come home and I see the lights on. It's comforting. I feel like I can go on one more day. Okay, if that's what you want. Sorry. No, it's okay. In that case, leave the housework and everything to me. It feels like we've really become family. Yeah, it really does. Fennel. Stella. Fennel, you haven't forgotten our promise, have you? You haven't forgotten me. Have you? I could never forget you. Yes. Shirley's just... I will now begin preparations to activate the Wings of Light. Walter, where did you go?
Marinus, why did you stop the fight? It was a perfect opportunity to finish Senel. Do you really believe that? What are you talking about? Walter pursued them into the Fallen Lands. Them? You mean Senel's group? Were you alright? My power felt weaker than normal. Just as I thought. Do you know why? That is the only place to which the blessings of Nerithus do not reach. That's why our ancestors called it the Fallen Lands. Do not approach them as long as they remain in that place. Commencing preparation. Is this it?
Moses, please stop acting like a child. Yo, C! Hello? How long were you planning to stay like that? S sorry it, it was just so sudden. That was such a cute scream. What are you talking about? Don't act like you don't know. I heard you loud and clear. Hey, Bubbles, how about the door? You gonna kick it or what? Kicking door! Okay, let's go! Whoa, this time it's all humid. Can there be lightning inside a building? With this humidity, they might have deliberately created the conditions for thunderstorms. See, are you scared of lightning? I'm not scared of lightning. I just don't like being startled all of a sudden. That's practically the same thing. Ooh, I just had a good idea. The next time lightning strikes, go hang on to Senny. What? And scream and say you're scared. I can't do that. This is your chance, silly. Are you gonna waste it? Boys are like putty when they see a girl's vulnerable side. Really? Um... You two look like you're having fun. Just a little. Oh... I'm certain the image we see once we touch that isn't going to be pleasant. Are you sure you're going to be all right, Senel? Why do you keep asking me that? Because you have a strong attachment to the Radiant. Wait, Coolidge, I'll join you. Jay. What did we just see? A shooting star. You've never seen one before? Of course I've seen one. I just want to know why we saw it is all. How should I know? Training is one less drop of blood in battle. Yeah, but push. There's the second one. The C 
sea? Yes, that was the sea. First a shooting star, and now the sea? I just don't get it. <sighs> Senu, relax. It's okay. We're all with you. Thanks. I'm fine. yourselves yeah, use this A large pillar of water? What does that mean? Hey, whoever is showing us this stuff, make things a little clearer, okay? Hmm, no response. Let's keep going. We need more information if we're going to draw any conclusions. What the hell are you doing? I'm, uh, not too good with loud noises. <laughs> <sighs> Chloe looks depressed. 
Wonder what's eating her. They're crying out loud, you stupid bandit! How can you be afraid of lightning? You're a savage! What's your problem all of a sudden? Oh, never mind. Someone tell me what's going on! Telling where this will lead us. We're on the ocean? Ah. Relax, Chloe, we're not sinking. It's okay. Hey, you're right. Why not? We're probably not in the real world. Ah, it's not real. Thank goodness. Ah! <clears throat> I apologize for my outbursts. Oh well, 
I guess it all worked out in the end. Shirley! She disappeared. She was staring straight up. Is something up there? There's the gate. All right! I've been waiting for this! Oh, yet another type. What luck. Uh, this one looks kind of hard. Now we finally understand the relationship between the sea, the shooting star, and the pillar of water. All the information came together in the end. But it's difficult to believe. Seriously? That shooting star was actually the white rectangular ship? Another tablet. What's drawn on this one? I see. Looks like the moment the shooting star, the white ship, fell. We can talk once we get back to camp.
shit. Don't go too far on your own. I know, I know. I see you like a little. Freeze Lancer! Whirlwind Blast! Reverse! Great. Well then, let's go over what we've seen again. Could it be that the Radiant are a different species that came from another world? I can't see any other explanation. The white ship did come down from the sky. That's pretty difficult to believe, though. It sounds so crazy. But you know, when you think about it, the Radiant are pretty different from us. Their hair glows, they breathe underwater, they make terror quests and fly through the air? Yes. The Radiant are a completely different species from us. We should probably consider what that means carefully. You two sure are emphasizing the word different. I think that's because that someone is thinking the same thing. Think back for a moment. What we wanted to know was the reason why humans and Radiant hate each other. Then we saw what we saw. What if that someone is saying that humans and Radiant are simply too different? And that the source of the hatred lies there. So it's telling us that peace is hopeless? No! Don't say Hell that! No. The Radiant themselves have declared us their enemies. We can't ignore the situation. But still... Honestly, when I learned that the Radiant came from another world, it scared me like nothing else ever has. Don't tell me the rest of you didn't feel something like that. Well... It doesn't matter where the Farron has come from. What about you two? Chloe? Moses? Do you really think it doesn't matter? In your hearts, aren't you thinking the same thing I am? Jay, that's enough! Whoever it is that's showing us these images, where are you? Show yourself! If you've got something to say, come out and say it. Stop playing around. Well? Hey! Damn it! Jay, you know who this someone is, don't you? Yes, well, perhaps it's time we talked about that. When we first came to the Quiet Lands, do you remember what I said we should do? You said we needed to ascertain what Nerefus is. Yes. Well, what do we currently know about this so-called Nerefus? We know that the Marinus is its agent. Exactly. Also, 
Shirley said she hears the voice of Nerefis. There was something else about Nerefis. What was it? The Raiding intend to purge mankind in accordance with the will of Nerefis. That's right. Doesn't that sound kind of similar to the images this someone has been showing us? Exactly. Very perceptive. As the Radiant are to Nerefis, so we are to that someone. Meaning what, exactly? That someone is... Also Nerefis? But that doesn't make any sense. If that someone were Nerefis, it would be strange for it to be supporting us. Right. So what could that mean? Another Nerefis in the Quiet Lands, separate from the one up above? That is what I believe. So this other Nerefis is the one that's been leading us? Yes. You sure about all this? So wait, just what is this Nerefis anyway? Groon? No way. No, look beyond her. But there's nothing, just... Yes. Nerefus is the will of the sea. The sea itself. <gasps> the entity we've been referring to as someone has been beside us the whole time. A universal presence, an overwhelming influence. And think of what would give solace to the Radiant, the Fairness, the people of the water. The sea. The Marinus true power is probably the ability to communicate with Nerefis. Right. She's its agent. Yeah, Shirl said she can hear the sea. Shirley is planning to use the power of Nerefis to do something. This much we can be sure of. Purge mankind. This Nerefis in the Quiet Lands must have sensed that danger and led us here. That's a nice theory, but you got any proof? None at all. Thought so. So we'll just have to ask. You who hears our voices, if I am right, please give us a sign. Tell us what the Radiant are trying to do. That's our next destination. Looks like we're about to the finale. I wonder what we're going to see. Don't run away now, Senel. You want to see the truth, don't you? No one's doing any running. I'll remember you said that. Don't let him get to you, Senel. You can have confidence in those three years you shared with Shirley. Confidence. Everything's hinging on your feelings. Yeah, I know. Three years since we started living here. Time sure flies. Thanks for everything you've done for me, Seno. What's up? It's not like we're saying goodbye or anything. I've been meaning to say that for ages. I wouldn't be here if it weren't for you. myself in order to save you. You haven't forgotten that, have you? Jay? You're still awake. Jay, you look scary! 
Really? Your eyes look like the J from long ago. Jay, are you planning to do something about Shirley by yourself? I'm worried about leaving it to them. I have more experience with certain matters. Yes, lots of experience. How is the Marinus? The wings of light show no signs of activation. I didn't expect it to take this long. It's possible that the Marinus awakening is not yet fully complete. What? If so, then Senel is likely the cause. Senel? That little... We must be prepared, just in case. Let us formulate a plan at once. a lot nicer than the last few. I don't mean to sound like Rune, but this really does feel like we're on a picnic. Doesn't it, Sunny? No. I know. Since it's so nice and all, why don't we stop here and have lunch? This isn't the time for that. Bubbles, open the door already! Oh, right! I'm on it! Okay, let's go in. Is this facility actually creating a temperate zone? Not too hot, not too cold. This feels great. You people are no fun at all. Groon, help me out. We're the only ones who can clear away these clouds of gloom.
And here's the first line. That must have been what the Radiant are planning to do. I've never seen a tower like that before. It may be a secret weapon that we don't know about. I wonder what it's capable of doing. That'll surely become clear as we proceed. Suspicious light dead ahead! It looked like the ocean around the legacy was shining. Was that the moment the weapon activated? That seems likely. Let's keep moving. There's the third light. Was that a tidal wave? So they used the power of the legacy to make that huge wave? If so, that would mean an enormous amount of energy was released. That secret weapon may be far more powerful than the Nerefus cannon. I've come this far. I'm going to see it through to the end. are the Laugh Brigade! Huh? This isn't the time to be joking around. Just shut up and watch. So, G-Girl. Yes? That was quite a surprise that the someone turned out to be Nerefis. Oh, yes. And then, it turns out to be the will of the sea. Can you believe it? Oh, uh, should I believe it? You better believe it! And now, I have a question for our friend Nessie to answer. Nessie? Tell us, Nessie. What color underwear is G-Girl wearing today? What are you thinking? You're making fun of Nerefus? Oh, nice timing, C. Way to play along. Let's see. Today they're... Oh. I seem to have forgotten them. What? Oh, okay. Thanks. You've been a great crowd. This is the Lab Brigade signing out.
Still not enough, huh? Fine, let's see, what next? Thanks for trying to cheer us up. Aw, oh, it was nothing. to know is what the Radiant intend to do. I know that. Or one could say, what the Marinus surely intends to do. Jay, quit and fly and stuff! It's part of my nature. Too? Shirley! Cheryl, what's with the cold stare? Shirley, wait! It's a gate! Shield! 
alive is that the power of their secret weapon I see what we just saw was the very moment of the cataclysm Sennel what's the cataclysm a legendary disaster in which half the world sank beneath the sea until now, there was never any concrete evidence that it actually happened. But now we know. The cataclysm really occurred, and it was the Marinus who caused it. And now they're trying to cause it again. Well, what do you think, Senna? Stop. Let's talk about this once we get back to camp. All right. I look forward to everyone's decision. Coolidge, are you all right? Chloe, did you see Shirley's expression too? Yes. Okay. Is that why you were surprised that last time? Yeah, it's the same expression. That was the second time I've seen it.
Coolidge, there's a tablet by your feet. That's the legacy in the middle there, and that pattern around it is... light? Cataclysm? Would the entire continent disappear into the sea? If it's the same as last time, then yes, it would. The Nerefus Cannon pales in comparison to this. The Nerefus Cannon could take out a mountain, but with this, it's the entire continent. So this is what Moritz meant by purging the Auraranus. We can't live without land! If it sinks, we're finished! Was that tower-looking thing the wings of Lat? Most likely. The Wings of Light would seem to be the enemy's secret weapon. Enemy? A device to cause the Cataclysm. Would Cheryl really do that? In any case... Determining the enemy's objective was a good step forward. We didn't even know that until now. Hang on a second. Why are you calling the Fairness the enemy? You weren't using that word before. I thought it would be best in order to accurately represent the situation. Hey! Do you all seriously think Shirley is going to cause another cataclysm? Well... There's no way she'd do that! This is Shirley we're talking about! We don't really know her that well. Then I'll tell you about her. Shirley couldn't hurt a fly. There's no way she could sink a continent and wipe out humanity. Hey, what's that about? You don't believe me? It's going to be okay. It'll all work out. Stop and look at the reality of the situation. How can you be so sure it's going to work out? Just what is Shirley to you? What? And don't try to claim she's your sister. Shirley herself declared that she's through with you. Jay! The time for playing brother and sister is long over. You little... Now hang on! You don't have to say it like that! This is no time to be mincing words. Or don't you mind if the cataclysm occurs again? Yeah, that's it. There's no need for us to worry like this. What do you mean? Everything will be fine as long as the Cataclysm doesn't happen, right? I'm going to convince Shirley. Senna. If I talk to her, I'm sure she'll understand. 
I'd like to know what makes you so confident. Hey, there's a light over there. What is that? It seems Nerefus is calling us. It must be trying to help us. Let's go check it out. What should we do? I think we should go. We can't just ignore it. Then let's get moving. I have to do something. Yeah, me. How is the Marinus? No change. In the previous battle, you captured several of Vaklov's soldiers, correct? You're confined in a room in the castle. I want you to question them and find one who meets a certain set of requirements. What I'm looking for is 